Well, first of all, I'd just like to uh, thank the organizers. This is such a wonderful reunion. Mm -hmm. Some people I have not seen in over 50 years. Mm -hmm. Tonight I saw Tyrone Robinson for the first time. Excuse me, uh, excuse me, Jewel. Uh, and I can tell you this. Uh, they might have had to see my tail, <laughs> but when June Manning hit Orangeburg High School, they found out with true intelligence. Yeah. <laughs> okay, before I get too embarrassed, I just keep going. <laughs> um, so unlike uh, Tyrone Robinson, who, who spoke about this every day, I managed to not speak about it. I, w I moved to Michigan and married that man over there, which was a good excuse to not come back. <laughs> and um, most of the people I was around had no idea of my history. They didn't know anything about high school or desegregation or Orangeburg, because I was so traumatized. I buried it all within myself, mm -hmm. which is why I had to write the book. But when I decided to write the book, I decided I really didn't want to write about my own experience. <coughs> Sorry. Mm -hmm. <coughs> my own experience because I had buried it so much and I, I didn't want to be re-traumatized. So I turned it into a history and I went all the way back to after the Civil War. And I talked about the fight that people had been fighting, like in Charleston, the teachers had been fighting in 1918 for equality mm -hmm. and the ability to get jobs. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. I had no idea. In 1918, there were teachers, black teachers in Charleston who could not get hired because they'd only hire white teachers to teach black children. Mm -hmm. wow. So I had to go back to tell that history. And then of course, you can't really talk about school desegregation in South Carolina if you don't talk about Clarendon County. So somehow we managed to grow up not knowing what we were owed, what we owed to those noble souls in Clarendon County. So I had to write a chapter about that. So basically, I decided to tell the story of how we got to that first day how we got to that point that we were going to school under court order. Why was there inequality with equal system? So yes, I, I wrote a history of how we got to that moment. Thank you. Before we move